there's been a lot of questions about the perfect line swiss so i want to just demonstrate you know how my day goes with wearing my wigs and then what the end result usually is especially for the perfect line swiss whether or not it lasts you know throughout the day and after i take my wig off will it wash away if i wash my wigs a lot of people have a lot of questions just because it is so hot outside and you guys know that the perfect line swiss product does kind of melt with heat i will be sure to link the wig um in today's video below in the description box you guys can definitely check there if you want to purchase or if you want a discount code so the wig in today's video I will be sure to put below in the description box I'm working with a loose wave texture that is 14 inches if you don't know what the perfect line Swiss concealer is um, I like to use this to hide the knots it's made specifically to hide knots on your lace wig so a lot of people always wonder if they are using this product and they wear it in high heat um, as far as the summer heat will it run they also wonder if it will wash off over time or after one wash when washing their wig so today I am going to show you guys what my end result look like by the end of my day um, but yeah basically this stick is a wax consistency it is only activated once you apply direct heat to it and what you would do is just you apply it all over the inside of your cap it comes in several different shades now once it's applied you can clearly see that there is no knot showing on this wig it just looks like scalp especially when you get the right color and the one thing i like about this the colors are true to color like for instance i use a tan color in this and it's the perfect scalp color for me it's not too white and they do have shades all the way from fair to the darkest skin tone so once you apply it inside that cap it's going to look like scalp because of the texture all right so let's talk about this hair a little bit this is a loose wave texture like i did some beautiful wand curls to it that's what i'm brushing out right now i could not figure out what type of style i wanted to do with this wig i couldn't figure if i want a side part a middle part it was just a mess i don't know you guys i just kind of went through this like phase where i just hated every style that i did so what i end up doing is just creating a side part and redoing the curls so today's video, I did not show the install. I used the same method that I used in my previous video from yesterday, if you guys seen that video, which was with the Even Wonder Lace. Yeah, I ended up switching my parting several times just because I felt like, like I said, I was very indecisive about what I wanted to do with my hairstyle. Um, but I like the way everything turned out. I do have a few flyaways. It's okay. So yeah, let's get started with this day. <laughs>
to take my wig off and show you guys exactly how this product holds up in water because a lot of you want to know if you wash it will the perfect line swiss wash away so we are going to test that but so far the parting and everything still looks good there's no product running with the perfect line swiss it's a very solid product it only will melt if you apply like direct heat to it not like just from you being out and about at least I have never had that problem with it. Um, so yeah, let me zoom in at the parting so you guys can see again, and then we will go and wash the wig. And let me just say this now, my wig application is definitely lifting, <laughs> lifting over here on the side. It's, I haven't really touched up that area, so it's starting to lift there. So if you see that, don't even worry about it. So here's a close up of how everything looks in that scalp area. It looks the exact same as it did once I applied it um, at the beginning. There really is no running of the product. It doesn't fade throughout the day. It stays onto the cap as you guys can see. And that hairline looks really good too. parting the hair you can kind of see everything is still good with it and as far as this hair because this hair is like that I think it's like a wavy texture I forget the exact color let me look this is a loose wave texture so as far as the curls and everything these curls actually held I'm sorry my hair look crazy but these curls actually held all day really surprised about that I wasn't even paying attention but the curls did pretty good for a loose wave texture because normally the loose wave has a little bit more texture so not like the body wave when you curl it the body wave tends to hold but yeah it did pretty good you guys um so yeah i will put this wig down in the description box i'm about to go take this wig off and um yeah just show you guys what the product so this is how the inside of the cap look with the perfect line swiss after a full day of wearing this wig as you can see the product is still inside the cap it's not removed it's not melted it's the same exact way so now i want to show you guys what would happen if you was to get into a pool or you know any kind of cool water would touch it um, so i'm just going to run it underneath some cool water so you can see exactly how the product behaves underneath water now when you put it in water as you can see it the product doesn't move at all the water kind of beads off of the product and it's still intact into the cap now if you wanted to remove this product then you would use a little bit of shampoo and warm water directly onto it with maybe a toothbrush old toothbrush or something like that and it comes right up but just getting in pools with cool water or just running it underneath cool water is not going to remove this product as you can see, it's still stuck to the cap and it doesn't rub off. Now the texture of this product is like skin almost because it has that wax consistency. So just rubbing my hands over it, as you can see, unlike makeup, it's not going to smudge or remove. So I will be sure to put this product and this wig down below in the description box for you guys, along with any discounts that I may have. But yeah, this product is really good at creating a fake scalp appearance under the wig. Thank you guys so much for watching.